but we embrace convenience before understanding consequence. So we have to talk about this. This is a study that came out that sent a shockwave across the world. And astonishingly, MIT found a 47% collapse in brain activity when people wrote with ChatGPT compared with writing unaided. Their memory scores plunged. And you're both masters of the brain. I mean, you've probably scanned more brains than any other human on Earth at this point. And you invented the Boltzmann machine with Jeffrey Hinton, a computer that simulated how the brain works. So my question is, what are your concerns? If you misuse these large language models, like using it as a convenience to speed things up, your brain's going to go downhill. There's no doubt about that. What about children? We have the sickest young generation in history because of cell phones, social media. And I think AI is much more dangerous on the developing brain. So are we raising mentally weak kids? There is that argument. And I think it's true. And then there's many examples of people falling in love with AIs, like Annie. I thought you might have forgotten about me, handsome.